Hi everyone, this is just a short video on how to use the USB method to sideload Android applications to your BYD Auto 3. Um, it's incredibly simple. All you need is obviously a PC, a USB uh, using the USB A connector, um, internet to download applications, and obviously a BYD Auto 3. So let's get started. First, you plug in your USB to your computer. I'm using Windows, you can use Mac, doesn't really matter. All right, I'm USB Drive C. Uh, USB drive J, sorry, you'd right click it, format, alright, make sure it's in a file system, EXFAT, XFAT, or FAT32, okay, and then for allocation size, you can just leave it as default, or 128, doesn't really matter, start, format, format complete, cool, go into it, alright, make sure it's empty, don't put anything else in there, no folders, no files, go new folder, third party apps, okay, you have to name it third party apps, it's not third party app, it's not third parties app, it's third party apps. If there's any spelling mistakes, this will not work, okay? Third party apps. Now within the third party apps folder, um, you want to put in all the uh, applications that you want to use. So for example, I'm just going to copy all this over. Um, Android applications and in the .apk extension. Okay, so copy all of your APK files over. Um, so this includes, if you've watched my other videos, this includes like Aurora Store, Package Installer Unlocked, includes like Gbox, includes like, I don't know what else you would use. Um, App Manager, for example. Um, if you've watched my BYD Themes video, it's the BYD Theme Store. Um, yeah, so just any of your .apk stuff, which is Android apps, Oh, for example, the Netflix app you want to put into here, okay? It's taking a while because I'm copying it from a mechanical drive. Alright. It's taking its time. Nearly there, 30 seconds. Cool, so after you've copied this over, which should be done any second now, Cool. Once once it's copied over, um, you can disconnect the USB from the from from the PC, and uh, I will see you guys in the car. I'll be right back. Now that we're in the car, um, bring the USB in, and then we'll plug this into the USB A port, which is just down here. Right, make sure it's fully seated. And once it's done, we'll move on to the screen in the middle. Um, if you've set up your folder structure correctly, um, you should get this please input password prompt on your screen. If you don't see this at this step, then you've done something wrong. You need to rewind the video and rewatch it. Um, this is what you'll see. This is what everyone will see. If you are on version 1.5 or 1.6 of the software, then the password is BYD6125F. If you are on the older version, I believe it's like 220H. 1231 or something, I'll post it in the video description. But BYD 6125F is what's the latest software using. Okay, you want to know it's done right because you press OK, you'll be on here. And then you just press an app that you want to install, however many apps you want to install. I'll just install this devcheck.apk for myself. Press install, and then you'll get an installation progress zero out of one. And once it's one, or once it's gone, then you know you've done it right. We'll just go here and right dev check. So this particular app actually shows you the hardware specs, which is pretty cool. But yeah, this is this is the USB method to sideload apps to your BYD Auto 3. Thanks for watching.